Get up now? No, lay on your back. I mean, you're not supposed to lay on your back as a uh, I'm hungry. Unhealthy! Put the bear on there. What are you, an expert now? We did it. That's not that bad. Ready to be parents. Guys, today is a sad day because today is the last time that I will be able to do Troom Troom Pregnancy Life Hacks. Because this video is gonna be going out right around when I'm about to hit 37 weeks per regante. And uh, it takes a lot to make one of these videos because I have to do stuff, you know, up and about in my house while not sitting down. And uh, I'm just, I'm just too tired, guys. I'm too slow moving, I'm too giant. My outfits are in a perpetual state of looking like I'm either going to bed or going to the gym, but I don't do either. I just sit around complaining how tired and achy I am. I feel like this is nature trying to make you look forward to the birth, which is gonna be horrible, but at least you know you won't be pregnant afterwards. <laughs> That's where I'm at right now. So this will be the last pregnancy life hack video. And I'm hoping that it gives me some really good life hacks to get me through the next like, oh God, I still have like a, another month almost. Three to four weeks. Trump, Trump, for the love of God, help me get through these last couple weeks. <laughs> but first I wanna give a quick shout out to today's video sponsor, Audible. Now I've admitted this before, but I am 100% a workaholic who finds it really difficult to just sit in one spot and relax. Right, Bobby? Yeah. Wait, are you recording right now? <laughs> Always. <laughs> Couple that with the fact that I have a baby on the way and there's just no way I'm gonna find time to sit in one spot, relax, and focus on just reading a book. And that's why Audible is such a lifesaver for me to still be able to keep up with the latest best-selling titles by just listening. While leaving the rest of me to still be productive or pretty soon take care of a baby at the same time. At Audible, you can find the largest selection of audiobooks, ranging from bestsellers and new releases to celebrity memoirs, languages, business, motivation, and more. Now, I personally always try to pick one novel and one work-related slash self-improvement book. So if you need a title to listen along with me, currently the novel audiobook that I'm listening to is called The Pact, written by Jodi Picoult, one of my favorite authors. If you're a fan of courtroom murder mysteries like me, you will love it. And my current work-related slash self-improvement audiobook is called Steampunks, YouTube and the Rebels Remaking Media, written by Robert Sinkle. If you really want to get motivated to create online content, this book is a must. As an Audible member, you will get one credit every month, good for any title in their entire premium selection, including the latest bestsellers. And no matter what, it will be yours to keep forever in your Audible library. You also now get full access to Audible's new Plus catalog. It's filled with thousands and thousands of audiobooks, original entertainment, guided fitness and meditation, sleep tracks for better rest, and podcasts, including ad-free versions of your favorite shows and exclusive series. All are included with your membership, so you can download and stream all you want, no credits needed. So be sure to visit audible.com slash Lauren Z, which you can also find and click in my description below, or just text Lauren Z to 500-500. And as always, new members can try Audible completely free for 30 days. Thank you so much to Audible for sponsoring today's video. And now back to your normal weird content. A big belly is a challenge. <sighs> that's not even- Your e back hurts. Girl, that's not even that big. You don't even know what big is. I'm big. This used to be me. I used to be your like, maybe hurts. it won't be so it's bad. It's very uncomfortable. I was wrong. Okay, what's the life hack then? Put on a fake belly. I mean, sure. <laughs> Okay, I wonder how big that watermelon is though. It'd have to be like, most pregnant women gain about 30 extra pounds. It'd have to be a 30 pound watermelon. Oh, come on, man. Come on, man. Okay, so I guess the life hack is if you're miserable, you should make your partner miserable with you. I can do that. So I'm gonna try and get a watermelon and attach it to Bobby and he's gonna have to try to bend over to get stuff. I just, I feel, this is not gonna be the same. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, bam, bam. <laughs> <laughs> Belly bump. Hey, Bobby, you know how I've been like kind of miserable lately? <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> of this. Because of that. Oh my God, it looks mad. It looks enormous. <laughs> <laughs> well, I thought it'd be a good idea if you were miserable with me. Awesome. Yes, I'm. Because gender I'm equality. Yeah. Okay, well, today, Troop Troop has told me that in order for us to bond over this, 
I need to make you as miserable as me. Miserable? Is there, what, what's the emphasis on miserable? I'm carrying like an extra 30, over 30 pounds on my body yeah, that I'm not used sucks. to. Yeah, <laughs> it's not fun. So, oh, that's don't possible. worry, we have this for you. It's not 30 pounds. No, I weighed it, it's like 10. Yeah. Three of these? Yeah. One, two, I didn't two, think we could fit three. it. I don't even know if I can get, I know we have a baby carrier upstairs, which probably would make this a lot easier, but Troom Troom said oh, we should use cling wrap. Oh, no, that's not gonna hold. No, I have to create a baby carrier out of this. Not just wrap like, it, like, just strap it around. So you gotta, yeah, so you gotta hold it. Yeah. I'm gonna like wrap it yeah. around you, but then like also give you straps and stuff. Why, so that I don't need that. We're gonna add another 20 pounds we with have saran a, wrap. <laughs> we have a, uh, a weighted chest thing, vest thing we could just put on and this. Do we have that? What, 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 you wanna try it? <laughs> I'll do it. to you. <laughs> I mean, it's gonna suck, so it'll make me miserable. This good. is nothing. <laughs> good. 20 pounds is nothing. I've been working out, I'm strong. You're looking really good there. <laughs> okay, so this is about. I think it's what do 20. Think? 20 it's pounds? The whole thing was either 30 or 40, so it's either 15 or 20. We yeah, took the back we, out. We took the back ones out. So I made it. We got to make you top heavy, yeah. off balance, and everything like me. Here you yeah. go. Here's the rest of your <sighs> baby. I'm hoping this holds, or else we're going to get watermelon all over the place. This is bringing back memories of when we did this for Halloween. Yeah. What yeah. was tape? Okay, so <laughs> I'm just going to keep Wait, going. You hold it, and I'll, I'll spin. Oh. <laughs> Go, can you get a little lower? Yeah, that's good right there. <laughs> Does it feel secure? Oh my god. Good thing I bought another thing of saran wrap. Hold it. I'm gonna get underneath it. There you go. Just... Woo! Alright, this sucks. You're fine. Oh, low, low. Right, I'm gonna take this off. Oh, you shoulder strapping me? Shoulder strapping. You're keeping this on for the rest of the video. <laughs> It's too much work. I'm gonna have to cut you out. I've committed now. Hope, hope nobody shows up at the I house. I literally just say I hope no one shows up. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> I'll answer the yeah, door. Yeah, I was just saying, I think you'd have to. Is Bobby home? <laughs> uh, he is. Uh, I don't know, what do you think? I, it feels fine to me. It doesn't do much, but it what helps. Do, what, the shoulder straps? <laughs> oh man. Do you feel top heavy? Is it really this bad? Yeah. Yeah? Why do you think I'm tired all the time? My legs hurt. Jeez. I can't, it's hard to get up. Ooh, that's what I wanted you to do. I'm gonna try and get, no way. I'll move the camera, hold up. Oh. Are you trying to get up? I meant like from the couch. I'm gonna try here first. Can I, I mean, yeah. Okay. Oh God. Oh yeah. Making pregnant lady sounds. Get up now? I'll lay on your back. <laughs> I mean, you're not supposed to lay on your back as a brain, uh, but it's going to crush uh, your stomach. No, it's not bad. Oh, okay. This is the most comfortable I've been so far. All right, now, now you're going to try and get up. Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, Dexter's very confused. It sucks for sure. He squats though. Yeah, so you could work out with that. Oh God, don't drop the baby. It's coming apart. You want shoulder support. No, all of our hard work. Well, she's, sit she's sitting there. I got a <laughs> it's good... a she, you got a she yeah. there. Good job. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's just you on the side. Where's Bobby? Oh. Hey. I told you not to swallow watermelon seeds. They grow on the outside. <laughs> this is what they warned us about when we were ah! crying. Oh, a diaper. Welcome to the diaper challenge. What is this? Okay, so it's not so much a pregnancy life hack, but a parent, like getting ready to be a parent Our first life hack. Is successfully swaddled. Okay, well, one, that's it's not swaddling, but sure. Two, I don't know how to put it. I have never put a diaper on anything. I've been told that the people at the hospital will show you how to do this. So I was kind of just banking on that, but maybe we should try to practice on stuffed animals like Troom Troom's telling us. Not a bad idea. Can't be that hard. Your oh. turn. Okay, so this life hack is just learning how to put a diaper on all different shaped things. I could even put a diaper on an emoji. Wow. The okay, next what's level happening is now? practicing on people. Oh God. I Perfect result. Well, uh, I'm not gonna diaper Bobby. <laughs> Maybe we could diaper Dexter. 
Dexter might might fit in some of the bigger diapers. I don't want to buy a whole pack of adult diapers just to try to do this to Bobby. All right, newly pregnant Bobby. Yes. <laughs> I don't think either of us have ever attempted to do a diaper. Yet. I've never, ever, ever done it. No, we're very prepared. I don't think it's going to be that difficult. No, I think the diaper part is easy. It's, it's the, the cleaning. <laughs> it's the cleaning. That takes getting accustomed to it. But yeah, so these look how tiny they are. They're so tiny. So these are like the wow. newborn ones. These are the real tiny ones. These are the first ones. But then we also got packs of the bigger ones <laughs> during our baby shower. So I figured we could use, we could try both. We'll try the little ones. The only thing I could find that would fit in it is this little doll. I like how this was a life hack. Uh, it was like, yeah, hack? just practice diapering on uh, I mean, stuffed animals. Worked. What do you mean it worked? You I'm getting know. practice. First time I got it. Do you want to do it first? Sure. <laughs> use your use your belly to hold her up. <laughs> you only got it's ba you only it's got backwards. It's backwards, it's really? Backwards. That's that's the No, the part with the cute design goes on the front. <laughs> You're failing already. I feel like I'm being very rough as well. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is going well. How's that weight? Heavy. You're probably hot too, aren't you? Oh boy. <laughs> oh my god, it takes up like half the doll's body. <laughs> Did good, I do it? Good job, I think. Plenty of room in there. It's, I mean, it looks right. Who knows? <laughs> We're just hoping the hospital will teach us. Is it tearing? What is no, I'm, I'm <laughs> folding it so it gets smaller so it fits. Good Ooh. job. Yay! I did it! What a life hack. All right, I guess I'll do the bigger one. I don't know if these are gonna fit this. This is the only like regular stuffed animal I could find. I'm gonna put the baby in the crib. Oh, oh my belly's in the way. <laughs> yeah, you put put him, put the thing on the, put the bear on there. What are you, an expert now? You just did one <laughs> diaper? I mean, a flat surface like a belly. I don't have a big, my belly doesn't protrude, I'm there. protrude that much. Then they can't see. Do you want to give them a play by play? Lauren's trying to get the side, the, <laughs> the left side in or the right side of it. It looks good so far. And strapping the, there's like a Velcro-ish kind of strap. I don't know. It's not Velcro. Is that it? Like but, you, don't, yeah. you don't have to peel anything? No, no peel. What? Diaper technology. Diaper tech. Get your fat. But in this thing, Teddy Bear. Oh, I did. Make, she's done. It's, <laughs> she's done it's it. kind of like, tuck it in. <laughs> I feel like it's cutting off circulation of the bear. <laughs> Squeeze everything out. Probably should have went a little higher. We could go a little higher. You just threw the bear. It's her. It's fine, skinny legend bear. <laughs> That's better. Right. It took us both, you know, two it took tries. Two, it. two attempts. We did it. That's not that bad. Ready? We're ready. <laughs> Ready to be parents. Thanks to Troom Troom. Oh God. This is Let's very... hope the hospital doesn't see this video or they're not gonna let us take the baby home. Should I try to diaper Dexter? <laughs> I don't think it's gonna fit. Ooh. Oh. Are you ready to get a change? It's not gonna fit. There's no way. <laughs> He's like, I don't like, no. Oh my God. <laughs> don't worry, we are throwing this diaper out. We will not use it. What, did you get it on one leg? Good job. There's no way. <laughs> There's no way. One leg, you're protected now. A pregnant woman's diet should be healthy and balanced. Wait. A pregnant woman's diet should be healthy and balanced. What is this? This looks like she took a pretzel and like just broke it into pieces, threw it into a bowl with milk. Is this a cereal? Can somebody tell me in the comments below if this is a cereal? Even if it is a cereal, it looks like just bread and milk, which sounds like the cereal of my dreams, but definitely not a healthy or balanced breakfast regardless. What is the cereal? That's not a cereal. It seems like the husband is trying to sabotage things. For breakfast, man. A mountain of fast food. For breakfast. Okay, first of all. <laughs> I would never look at french fries like this, especially while pregnant. I'd be looking at them like, like those fries would not stand a chance. They're mine now. She's disgusted by them. No. And yes. the smell makes her sick. What? Mm. Oh my God. Come on, girl. Jack doesn't even notice. Chips? That's too much. Dude. Okay. You're getting, you're oh, out of no. control. Out of control. Kill him. Kill him. <laughs> Hair dryers and chips are incompatible. How is this a life hack? I feel like they ran out of life hacks for pregnant people. I feel like there is no life hack. We had a couple little good life hacks for the first one. No, sorry. None of them were good. I'm sorry. I didn't remember. I feel like they did those life hacks and then they were like, you know what? Pregnancy's just 
just not going to be easy. There's no real way to life hack it. So we're just going to make up stuff. So getting more is easy. I'm pretty sure this guy is a sociopath. Break out the big guns. Why? No more junk food. Why? Why is this a life hack? <laughs> okay, guys, Troop Troop has now become terrifying to me. So apparently I need to tell Bobby to go have a plate of chips and then do this for no reason. Life hack, yay! These are the worst, oh my god. I didn't think life hacks could get worse. They've got, they've officially gotten worse with this video. Uh, are those chips? Yeah, I'm hungry. Unhealthy! <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh my God, you made a mess, Bobby. You made a mess. I got, <laughs> got in my inside here. I saved your insides from the the unhealthiness that is... Ch actually, these are like not that bad. <laughs> these chips are not that bad. Okay. Dexter, don't eat them. Oh boy. A pregnant girl's best friends are pillows. Yeah. <laughs> is this gonna be an pillows. actual life hack? Is the life hack just make a pillow for it? Oh my God, I, I'm so on board with this as a life what hack. What a cozy nest with a very comfortable space for the stomach. That's actually a pretty okay life hack to be able to lay on your stomach. You just gotta like prop yourself up enough and then, ooh. I'm gonna take it a step further though cause this is just, this isn't enough. <laughs> I want to make pillow world. <laughs> I'm gonna take every pillow I can find from around the house and put it on my bed and make pillow world. Uh, Lauren? Are you under all these pillows? Are you in here? Welcome to Pillow World. Okay. I love it. <laughs> I got all the pillows from everywhere in the house and just stacked them. I'm laying on pillows. I'm covered in pillows. It's just pillows everywhere. That's a lot of pillows. I'm finally comfortable. Dexter, come into Pillow World. Dexter, do you have access to Pillow World? Where is he? <laughs> All right, well, that's it for the last Troom Troom pregnancy life hacks that I will be doing during this pregnancy. Uh, I learned nothing. None of these are going to help me except for maybe Pillow World. But if none of these helped you either, then make sure to leave a like before you go. Also, if you're looking for something else to watch, why not check out one of these videos? Also, make sure to subscribe, especially if you want to find out when I actually have the baby. I will be posting once I do to keep you guys in the loop. Plus, it's totally free and it's right there. It's super easy. And as always, I will see you guys soon.